Good evening. Hi. Uh, my name is Kai Salem. I live at 212 Power Street in Providence. I've lived in Providence for four years, and over these four years, I've gotten a chance to know a lot of people here. Um, about three summers ago, I spent my summer going door to door in Providence, uh, in West Providence, talking to people about their environment, how they perceive the green infrastructure, their trees, their clean air and water. And everyone in that neighborhood talked about how much they loved their trees, loved having clean air and clean water. That's not surprising because that should be a human right. This is true in South Providence also, where this port is going to be built. For every person in this room, there are thousands more people who will experience the public health impacts that Monica talked about earlier. We cannot stand here, you cannot stand here, and make a decision that impacts them like this. I also deeply care about climate change. That's what I plan to spend my life working on, fighting against, because people in your generation left climate change for people in my generation to deal with. The decision that you make here today has an impact on climate change, it impacts me, it impacts the people in South Providence, mostly it impacts the people who don't have the power to fight back, don't have the privilege, don't have the ability to stay in air conditioning. This is a global issue. There's a small window for environmental justice, a small window for climate justice to stave off the climate impacts that are going to most impact the most vulnerable, and that window is already closing. It's not closed already. This decision today has far-reaching impacts and it's part of a larger movement that is going to destroy world, climate, our children if we don't act now. I think that I want you to understand the, the, the importance of your decision uh, in the coming months on this plant as part of this larger movement. And I really encourage you, I implore you to make a decision that protects the climate for me, for my generation going forward, and that protects the people of South Providence who are already vulnerable to so many public health impacts. Don't make the wrong decision.